Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel. If you are new here, I am Daquana White. I bring you plus size fashion content as well as lifestyle and beauty content. So today I'm actually bringing you guys a Shein trial haul, which I'm super excited about. Um, there will be some pieces that look kind of style, but I probably wouldn't wear them together necessarily. So yeah, just keep that in mind. <laughs> keep that in mind. Um, I do style looks over on Instagram. I will be posting more pictures of me and style looks. But you know, reels have been taken off and uh, TikToks have been taken off and people haven't actually been getting a chance. The algorithm hasn't been showing people pictures. So um, I'll try to do like styling reels and pictures and things like that. So you guys can see how I do style my outfits. Um, I will, oh, if I didn't mention, thank you Shein for sponsoring this video. I do have a coupon code, which is the Quanta Q2. Everything that I do try on will be on the screen. I will name it on the screen as well as put the prices and the size that I tried it on in. And it will be linked down below. Okay, I think that's all the housekeeping on my head. It's a Thrifty Slay Diana unit in 18 inches. It is a closure unit. It's beautiful. It's a loose wave. I did add some wand curls, but they fell out a little bit because I did it like four days ago, three days ago or something like that. So yeah, and I wore this wig. This is like my third time or fourth time wearing this wig, but super cute. Absolutely love it. Let's go ahead and hop into the haul. I feel like that's everything that you guys needed to know. Um, again, everything that I try on will be linked down below. So the first thing we have here is this two-piece set. I want to say that this was actually a collab with a designer. Don't quote me on that, but I think it was. I was really scared of it because I didn't think that the pants would fit me. Um, I will say they are a little snug in like this area. I feel like they can easily give you like a little thigh crease. Um, but I do feel like the top actually, you know, complements this. It's really, really nice. I want to, I'm 5'4". And I would want the pants to be a little bit longer on me because I feel like now I'm obligated to do a really cute complimentary shoe. Whereas if they were longer, I could just do a simple black shoe, flat or heel. And you wouldn't really see it, but it'll be there. So yeah, I love this. You guys know I'm a, a fan of showing skin, midriff, you know, whatever, right? Um, I do like fitted clothes. I do like fit and flare. I like a lot of things. So that's just all to say that I can appreciate a modest outfit. I can appreciate something that's a little more covered up like this, like super cute. I want to say, yeah, it is button, um, functional buttons all the way down. I would say once I get about here, it'll probably start to buckle a little bit, but you know, it's not too bad. I like the amount of material. I like the print. It's definitely still vivid with the, even though it's like a darker color, it's still vivid, if that makes sense. Like it's bold, it's out there, and it's vibrant. So I love this, and I love the saturation of the blues and the blacks and the, what is that, a yellow or orange? The orange. <laughs> so here we have the back, and this is how long it is. I love this maxi top, and I definitely would wear it separately, like with a black jean, cute strappy heel or something like that or a booty like this can go so many ways or you can take like that blue color in there and do like a black um or a blue over the knee boot with a black jean that could be really really cute so you can definitely play around with this like i said i'm not a fan of the length of the pants but it can be worked with i love the top oh she is gorgeous this color is gorgeous i absolutely love everything about this two-piece set so it's like a crinkly material it actually reminds me of the like the plissy plissé sets those are really really cute but this one isn't that material it doesn't have that same sheen to it but i like that it's more so like a crinkly material it has a nice weight to it but it's still breathable and airy it feels like a luxury <laughs> okay she in um so one thing i do like about it is that it is fully function with the buttons even though i would still only do like two probably flip that and make it like a v-neck does have this collar here um i like the look of the sleeve kind of cuffed a little like it seems a little effortless in a sense but i still tried okay i still put myself together i still tried so of course you can undo this you don't have to tuck in one side you can actually fully button it if you choose to or kind of leave it like this i love this it's so chill i would dress it up um maybe like a simple heel cute purse like you don't have to do too much with it um a nice glass well sunglasses or shade i think that would be really really cute so yeah 
she's cute she's stretchy and she's comfortable this is how she's looking in the back love the length of the pant as well and the length of the top it's really rare where i actually get tops that cover my butt and today i filmed two hauls and so far i've been getting some really nice items so i'm super uber excited super uber excited i usually say super uber super uber i like that better so anywho that's this two-piece set i'll show you all the sets then we'll hop into dresses then we'll go into bottoms and jackets and coats yeah i love this it's so so cute so let's go ahead and get into this two-piece set i definitely feel like this is new year's or birthday outfit um for new year's it does get chilly okay it's it's winter the dead of the winter and i feel like a fur coat or something like that will look so good over top of this um i love the stretch factor here i do feel like i need to pull it up some okay um you do have oh stay up stay up okay so you do have this like black band um i probably wouldn't have put a black band if i was in, but then again you can't really see it so does it really matter so one thing i love about this is the side slits of the top like even if oh i didn't know this was a tag i'm like what is this so even if like when i get graphic tees and stuff i typically put a slit in the sides because i think it just shapes better and it falls better on i think that's really really cute i love that it is tube top i do have a bra on but i kind of tucked in a strap so yeah we still got a little bit of support but i do like this it has a little bit of rouge in here sparkly comfortable very very stretchy i like the sheen it's not too much it's not doing too much but super cute so then this is the back i do feel like the top could come a little bit lower it just rides up so yeah that's how that's looking back there and lastly i love the length of this pant i think it's the perfect length for a boot for a heel for a flat whatever the case may be i like the length of it i love my my pants to fall like over my foot i don't like it to look high i don't know that's just me but that is this two-piece set here oh look at it oh it's so subtle and cute so here we have this two-piece set it is so freaking cute it's like a sweatsuit and a swell sweat jacket and a skirt but it's too short in the back i also had some that was like pants and um some of this stuff by the way is from the shein fit plus collection some is from the regular like shein curve collection so this was shein curve and then i had that white um well a white sweatsuit from she and curve and it was a 4x but the pants did not work i'll link it down below so you can see it but i couldn't try it on for you all i'm gonna keep the jacket but the pants were too tight so anywho into this gray one i love this it's so freaking cute and i just wish that it was longer in the back honestly i don't think sometimes people or these companies design with booties in mind because the length of the skirt in the back should be illegal but anywho i know some people do like to wear their things this short and honestly some people might even hike it up a little more i see a range of people who wear clothes different body types larger smaller the in-between and um it looks good on some but for me personally again the front is not too bad but the back y'all hopefully i don't even have to blur this out like what is going on it is too freaking short too short but i do love how it fits like how this fits up here how it fits in the front it's cute and i love like gray sweatsuits i think gray sweatpants and sweat tops look so so nice so kind of disappointed about that but anywho that is this two-piece set does have stretch to it but again i just don't like the length of the skirt so here we have this dress it actually reminds me of a hot chocolate a cup of hot chocolate with some marshmallows on top it is so so cute it's better than i expected it to be it's like a sweater dress it is like a knitted feel to it um it's not super heavy but it does still feel like you could wear this in the fall and the winter definitely given like a thanksgiving dinner outfit i think this is so so cute and it's really really comfortable okay um i could see like some knee boots with this heels booties some tights I, and honestly i don't even you don't have to wear tights but i know it's getting cold and people are like oh my god you need something on your leg uh. and by the way let's just hop into the naysayers real quick because i know people are like why are you still doing shein hauls haven't you heard controversy and things like that i have to sneeze 
okay it went away you know i'm about to say i'm allergic to the bullshit but either way <laughs> um i want people to stop trying to quote unquote recommend other places like i know other places exist but how about going to those other places and telling them to reach out and tap on our shoulders to actually influence, like be an influencer, right? <laughs> to showcase these items from their companies instead of just saying, oh my gosh, she in is da 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 da. All the conspiracies and all this, that, and the third. And I don't want to say conspiracies because people are like, oh, so you don't believe it's happening or whatever the case is. So all the drama that's going on and that's surrounding this company as if those other major brands that you guys are wearing, not you. But the naysayers are wearing are not operating under the same conditions so with that being said i'm not saying i'm gonna oh i'm just gonna keep contributing to the problem like just know i'm in a contract like girl you paying for my lawyer fees you paying for this you paying for that but i want people to also know like me personally i have contracts to abide by and none of these people are gonna buy me out of my contracts right none of these people are gonna pay for lawyers right so with that being said I just don't, I don't know. People always put it on the quote unquote influencers and celebrities and this, that, and the third. But it's like, go tap on the shoulders of the people that y'all actually want us to wear then. How about that? How about that? But anywho, the back of this dress. <laughs> Sometimes y'all, I know, I don't, I like to stay positive and I love the support and I love you guys and I always say, you know, I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for you all. So I don't try to shit on people, but, um, you know, it's just like, people be trying to shit on us. Like, for what? For taking opportunities that are presented to us, right? And not to say all money is good money, but at the end of the day, the brands that y'all want us to try, we'll be trying them for the free, promoting them for the free, and they'll be getting free promotion. We're not getting paid for it. This is our living, right? For people who don't have other businesses and other obligations and things that they're doing and are strictly influencers and people don't i don't know so anywho that is this dress that was my rant and yeah i hope you guys can understand like affordable fashion is always going to be in people want affordable things people want trendy things you know it's some things like and then the recommendations for like people are like oh well don't wear this wear that the that's were hideous. I don't want to wear that. And that's not, I've actually tried the brands that were recommended for free. They didn't tap on my shoulder and say, thank you for that YouTube video. Thank you for that TikTok. No. So, anywho, let's go ahead and hop into the next dress. So, I actually love this dress with like a statement boot. I think that'd be really, really cute. Even a belt. Now, it does have these drawstrings on the side where you can control like the erosion and stuff there. But I feel like it just needs a little something more. So I would definitely probably put a belt on top of it and do a statement boot. I don't know. That's just me. I love how effortless it is, though. Like, I have to worry. Well, you don't have to worry about what's underneath. Um, it is a little sheer. So let me not say that. <laughs> so you definitely want to wear, like, a black or a, new, a dark brown underneath. But other than that, <laughs> you don't have to worry about, like, shapewear and things like that. Or can I wear a thong? Can I wear this? Like you good okay so um like i said i would like to style this with a pop color i feel like i love a black dress but maybe add some silver or some white or something of that nature and what's funny i actually have a few things like two accessories well, two purses and one pair of boots that i do have to show you from Shein. i'll show you that a little bit later but i do feel like this needs something but it's still like a chill piece i feel like it will look great on all body types i honestly I don't even be caring for real because people are like, oh, well, this body type shouldn't wear body tons. You should wear fit and flare. You should wear a skater. You should wear peplum. I feel like wear whatever you want. I say this in all my hauls, honestly. I feel like I always have that little insert. But um, I do feel like this would be appreciated and flattering on all body types. And, you know, people will be comfortable wearing it, I guess I should say. But that is this dress here. It is fully functional with the buttons. No buckling. So I do appreciate that. And I want to say it feels double layered, but it's not. So like I said, it probably is sheer in the back because it is like a lightweight but for some reason it's not showing up sheer i don't know what that is okay so here we have this dress and we don't have any like hold over there 
but then I feel like this lid is not doing what it's supposed to like I don't know y'all this one I, I can't I can't get jiggy with it I'm assuming this goes like on the shoulder or hang I'm assuming it goes on the shoulder like it doesn't look right hanging off so yeah that's how this is looking it's like this extra piece of material um yeah I don't I don't know the color is gorgeous the material is gorgeous but y'all what we doing over here she in the birds hey but anywho this could have been cute color is gorgeous but it just doesn't work for me it's not doing it for me so yeah that is this dress here okay so here we have these two pieces they are like separate pieces this skirt i want to say came with like a floral type top it was not given so i just put on my little cami that i wore today <laughs> and um this little oversized well it's not really oversized but it's supposed to be like an oversized corduroy shirt or jacket and it's cute i call it a jacket but it honestly just feels like a top. And um, I want to say Shein was one of the first places where I was getting like those corduroy tops that were color blocked that everybody loved. So I like this one. Uh, I don't really see it being buttoned for me. So that's a dub. But other than that, let's get into this skirt. Love this skirt. It is so freaking cute. Hold on. I like to scrunch it up like so it's not feeling like it's under my stomach. I don't know. But anywho, love the color, love the fit. I want to say this is Shein Fit Plus and this is Shein Curve. So it's given. I love this little slit over here. And it's not too short. So it's not too short in the back. I mean, it is a short skirt, but it's not too short in the back. So I like that about this. Would I wear them together? I don't know. I don't know if I would rock these together, but um, just for showing purposes, for viewing purposes, this is those two items. Um, the skirt does have stretch. It does have a zipper in the back. I didn't even have to unzip it. I just stepped right into it. The top doesn't have stretch at all. So let's go ahead and hop into the next two pieces. So instead of two items, I actually decided to give this skirt a moment on its own. I think it's really cute. I know some people want it to like flare out a little more like that. Of course I would love that, but I think it actually is a statement. Like I love the sheen to it. I love the pleat in. Um, it is like a stretch waistband. This part of the material doesn't really have that much stretch. It's just a lot of it. So it looks really, really flowy. Um, so yeah, that is this skirt. Again, waistband has stretch, but this part does not. And this is the length of it in the back. I do feel like it comes up a little bit higher in the back with the booty so yeah that is this here this coat is everything or this jacket is everything i never knew i needed like i love it this jacket is everything it doesn't have a hood though it feels like a raincoat not super swishy it's given like a trench coat mixed with a raincoat it does have pockets but it actually has a faux pocket this isn't even a real pocket but it has like the things on the inside i guess you would have to cut it and make it if you wanted a pocket that's odd but anywho um this jacket is cute though i love the black at the top with the khaki at the bottom love that you can zip it and then like draw string it here i think that's definitely a vibe you guys know me i would just pull the drawstring where did it go oh man okay i would just pull that boom boom have a fire outfit underneath and just have it as like an overcoat bomb so here we have this pant. I love this pant, but I don't like the length. The actual material is nice and thick. It's not sheer. It feels like a high quality, but the actual length is not for me. Like I like the little, you know, fit and flare vibe, the little ruffle at the bottom, but it's just, I wish it was a little, just like three inches or two inches, a little bit longer and hit my foot. Um, but other than that, like, the actual feel and the height, like, that they come to are re is really, really nice. But, yeah, I just want it to be longer. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. But that's this outfit. We have three more fits. And I want to get into these pink boots. Come on. Baby, if you are not a hill girl, these will not be for you. And I am not a hill girl, so these are not for me. But they are super duper cute. I'm not going to hold y'all. I'm not going to lie about that. They are so cute. They're like this platform. It reminds me of like a Barbie booty, stretchy, all that. 
Um, I don't know. I'm just not so used to being so high off the ground. I don't know how I feel about them, okay? Again, I'll pop a picture up on the screen so you can get a little more detail. So then we have this like faux suede, or it might not be faux, I don't know, but I'm pretty sure it's faux. Faux suede uh, mini skirt with the fringe. I don't know, I'm giving Barbie cowgirl. I don't know, but it's definitely really, really cute. Y'all see me standing in one place, child, because if I... I cannot. I'm not even going to speak that into the atmosphere. I've already sprained my ankle one time when I was in, like playing volleyball in college. But, girl, I don't got time for that today. But, anywho, the skirt is stretchy, but it's definitely short. So, I'm not really a huge fan of that in the back. I just feel like it could be a little bit longer. I don't know why they skimp us out on material. But, anywho, then we have this, like, cow print. Needed this because I got a cow print purse want to say i got a cow print hat but i don't remember but it is zipper faux fur really really soft it does have pockets which are really cute i did crop it just for the look for the photos of everything but um i'll unzip it for you all and yeah so this is the length of it if it's just like what in the world is coming out here this is the length of it if it's just out. So, yeah, that is this outfit. Let me slowly turn around, y'all, because I don't got time. But, like I said, the skirt is too short, so that wouldn't work for me. So, here we have this outfit. I'll start with the purse because I've been waiting to wear this purse. I do feel like once you have stuff in it, it'll look better because right now it's just like, it's like a, you know, it's flexible. But I feel like once you have things and fill it out more, it'll be really, really cute. Like, look at it. Anyways, um, love this purse. Can't wait to wear her. I have been holding her. And every time I'm doing hauls and stuff, I'm like, oh, I'll wear it with a silver purse, a silver purse, a silver purse. And this is the purse that I was talking about. Now, don't put too much in here because this little chain right here is not that sturdy. It's like them crop chain charms. They break easy, so don't try to do too much with it, okay? But um, then we have this faux fur jacket. This was from the Shein Curve line, and this these jeans were from the Shein Fit Plus line, by the way. But this jacket, it has nice room in the arms. I don't feel tight or squeezed or anything like that. Definitely feel like I need it. Um, I love faux fur. Love a crop. Love it all. So, yeah, it's really comfortable. It doesn't have, like, a button or anything. It's just, like, a throw on, you know? So getting into these pink jeans now y'all these are supposed to be like a us 28 feels like a us 20 maybe 18 i'm not even gonna hold you typically i can do a 24 22 22 24 whatever but these right here they are just too tight in the crotch area and i am like you know i have lost like 13 pounds since august so i'm like eh, i could you know keep them around but then i don't like the length I feel like the flare is a lot. The length is not doing it for me. So, yeah. I don't really know about this pair of jeans. I was super excited to try them. If I were to wear them, I would have to take this flare out a little. And, you know, make it more so like a straight leg or a boot cut. Because I'm not feeling that. And this is how it looks in the back. They don't go up high at all. So, I feel like we're getting butt crack action. Can y'all see? <laughs> so, yeah. I don't know how I feel about these. Y'all let me know. So here we have this outfit, okay? I love the length of this skirt. I like that it's not like super duper short. The pockets are functional. I feel like it's a little twisted though. Like it needs to be a little turned around. But anywho, love the color. And I'm actually doing something real dope. It's going to be on TikTok and Instagram. I don't know about it being on YouTube just because it's going to be a lot of work already. Like a lot a lot of work so yeah catch it on instagram and tiktok but anywho this skirt is gonna be perfect i think for the outfit i'm looking or trying to do um like i said love the length it's from the shein fit plus collection i think this is shein curve the jackets at shein curve are just always better <laughs> i don't know why um so yeah and i also paired that with this what do you call it like a bubble type purse and i have a bubble coat bubble vest and that's about it bubble coat and bubble vest <laughs> that's black and i want to wear that with it like i have to and i've been trying to get my hands on like that name brand tell easy that's bubble so to have this is close enough for me <laughs> i'm definitely gonna rock it it's super cute it's definitely trendy 
So this coat here is actually like a bandana print and I have a purse that's bandana print and a bucket hat. So I'm lit. Well, actually, I don't know. The bucket hat was kind of too small. So I do have the purse. So I'm really happy about this. I wouldn't wear this together. I probably do like an all black fit, maybe some panda dunks and then have like the um, bandana purse, bandana this. And yeah, I think that'd be really, really cute. But that is this outfit here. How it looks in the back. Does have side slits on the skirt. And they're not too much. Like, they're not too much because the skirt is long. I could definitely see this skirt with, like, a um a knee boot. So, that concludes my sheet and haul. I tried on some Shein Curve stuff, some Shein Fit Plus stuff. Again, all those names, prices, sizes, all that will be on the screen. Everything that I tried on will be linked down below. And, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. My coupon code is the Q2. On my head is 50 Slay. On my lashes is 50 Slay as well. Always linked in the description. And I also started a new podcast. So if you haven't already, check it out. The Delicate Dynamic. I actually posted a new episode. I think I'm going to do it on Halloween. But I'm like, are people going to tune in? But people can always tune in throughout the week. So I think I'm going to drop it on Halloween um, or the next day after. So November 1st. I think we can start at, yeah, maybe November 1st. But I hope you guys enjoy. Comment your favorite pieces down below. And yeah, let me know your thoughts.